Hey guys, I'm just gonna do this in a video because there's so much information uh, I just gathered. So I filed a report with the uh, DMV License and Theft Bureau asking for clarification on how to make my dune buggy street legal. And actually a guy called me and he was super nice and super informed. And he actually admitted that a lot of this stuff is like gray areas and it's very hard to come by for information. But this guy luckily was very, very experienced at the DMV. Uh, must have been some a higher up dude. But he actually like gave me his phone number and everything because he, I think, respected what I was trying to do. Uh, so here's the deal. There is a classification of vehicles called low speed vehicles, a different classification of vehicles called modified utility vehicles, a third classification of vehicles called golf carts, and a fourth classification of vehicles called custom built cars. Now, to make a street legal custom built car or modified utility vehicle, they actually have to be manufactured by an approved manufacturer that has to go through a licensing process with the, the Department of Transportation. And so if you put something together yourself or buy something that's not from an approved manufacturer, it doesn't matter how much you modify it, uh, they will not approve it. Um, so that was actually very disappointing. Um, and a little shady that there's this kind of backdoor agreements with these companies. They have to go through this process and they get on the, the short list. Um, so when it comes to, uh, what was the other thing? Low speed vehicles, same deal. Uh, they have to be made by a certain manufacturer. Uh, they're typically electric, uh, but it's similar process. It has to be improved manufacturer and then you can modify it, but you can't change the classification like you can't change a low speed vehicle into a car because like it was manufactured by that and it'll never be approved by the department of transportation as a, as a car to drive on the highway now with golf carts and related things like that you see them driving away around some of them with license plates and stuff like that in neighborhoods and streets and stuff and so there's two different things going on there. Some towns in North Carolina actually uh, will grant you a sticker from the town that allows you to drive on town roads. And that's completely outside of the DMV. You actually go to the town to get this special sticker. They come out to look at your golf cart or vehicle or whatever, and they, they'll approve it. It has nothing to do with the DMV. Now, if the golf cart is also manufactured by one of these approved manufacturers, then similar to the other process, you can go to that DMV and actually get it registered and get a license plate also. But that's two different things. So my current goal here is to try to get my dune buggy at least approved to drive in the town under, under this separate process. And the guy seemed to think that that might work uh, for at least Holly Springs and whatever other town I have to bring it, I can bring it to. So we'll see.